Hey guys, welcome to ITS Tactical. Today I'm going to do a quick demonstration on how to tie a Japanese square lashing. And you're going to need a section of cord here. And I'm using paracord for this demonstration, but you should try, probably just try to stick with natural fiber rope. That's the best for tying lashings. Once you find your midpoint, you're going to wrap it around the bottommost pole that you're creating your lashing on. And while you're doing this, it's important to pull this thing tight, just like any lashing. You're going to go around the back side of this. down across and you'll see at this point you've got kind of a diagonal wrapping there around the back side and back up so pausing at this point you've got two wraps on the left side three wraps on the right side you're going to take it around the back side one more time and I'll show you what this looks like in the back here so you've got four on the top three on the bottom and this wrapping is actually going to come it's going to split itself. So one's going to go to the top, one's going to go to the bottom, and that bottommost strand creates the last wrap of that X in the middle. Now pulling tight, the next step of this is going to be create, creating frapping turns. So right here, rope is going to cross, be pulled tight, come around to this side, and the same thing on this side. It's going to cross, Get this back of my finger here and pull it tight. Now they're going to meet down at the bottom here. Again, you'll know it's the bottom because the left side has two turns, two wrappings, and the right side has three. And you're going to create a square knot. It's a little bit different tying a square knot at this angle. So forgive me if I'm not on camera while I'm doing this. And there's your square knot. So that finishes off the Japanese square lashing. But what you can do for extra security is tie a, a hitch in each side. So you can wrap around and tuck inside, creating kind of a locking hitch on each side here. Do that on the left. And there is our Japanese square lashing. Hope you enjoyed this knot of the week, and please let us know if you have any questions in the comments. And thanks for watching.